All right, we started at 221.8, now we're down to 218.4. I'm not where I want to be, so it's definitely time for me to go hit the gym because I need to lose more weight, put on more muscle, and it will second half unless I go to the gym. So back in the day, I used to do the pec deck all the time and I honestly got tired of it. I don't remember why. I think it was just I wasn't progressing and it just got I'm tired of doing the movements. So, and then right before my injury, I started doing it again, and it felt really good. So, I think it's time for me to bring it back. <sighs> oh, man, that's a good deep stretch. My chest is 100%, without a doubt, going to be sort of fucked tomorrow. Sort of fucked tomorrow. How heavy should we go? I'm at. 110 and I'm pretty sure the most I've ever done is like 150 to like 170 maybe But I don't think I can go to 170 right now. I'm pretty sure the first time or last time I did it It was made for a max of three rounds, but uh, Fuck it. Why not 170? <sighs> 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 Ugh. They weren't the best reps, I'm not gonna lie, that shit was heavy as fuck, but those partials at the end are definitely gonna help out in the long run, so something to maybe start doing is the partials to whatever range of motion you can, it's definitely gonna help out. Ugh. So the most I've ever done on this machine right here is like 115, 120, I think. I have to look back, but I'm pretty close to that number. And uh, I'm gonna do my best to do at least 115 again. My chest is already a little exhausted from the pec deck. Okay, I think I'm in a good spot. Now let me add the 25. Yeah, I'll do a couple of quick reps and a couple of quick sets just to warm up in the, in the motion before working on my working set, which is gonna be 115 at least. So and just like that, I have 225s on yeah, each side. Sorry, 125 on each side. And just like that, I have a 25 on each side. Just by snapping my fingers, crazy, weird, strange. Anyways, all right, let's do another set. Oh yeah, that feels better. I mean, this already feels heavy, so let me give myself a good amount of rest time. I'm gonna wait to snap my fingers to get this weight on here. You know what, screw it. And just like that, 45s appeared on each side. So I'm 25, so good break, pretty easy. I definitely need a long rest period before I do this set. What's up, dude? Huh? <sighs> Just a few reps. Let's uh, let's add those 25 pounds on now. Yeah, there we go. 45, 45, 25, right? So that's 90 plus 25, that's 115. Also that's 115. Last time I did this math, got it all. No, it's 105. God fucking damn it. It's not 115. I gotta do this fucking math on a calculator because I am math illiterate. So 90 plus 25, okay, it is 115. 15 max of eight reps. And that was about a month ago on September 8th. So I should still have all that shrink. If not, I should get like six reps or close to six reps. My only concern is that I exhausted my chest already so much that I'm not gonna be able to because of the pack deck. And the other thing is, I trained biceps and triceps yesterday, you know? So my triceps are a little exhausted. Uh, they're, not, they're not feeling sore, they're not feeling weak or anything, but that might play a part in how much I'm able to push. Because even though this is a chest movement, my triceps are still being activated to some extent. So let's give that a try. Uh. Oh. 
I pushed myself and I tried, I tried to get it back up, but nope. My body just said, no, no, thank you. Not today. It's not happening. Fuck you. And uh, it did. It told me. So, nonetheless, I'm going to do whatever I can with the weight that I have on here. I'm not going to go lighter. Uh, if I'm only able to do two reps, I'm only able to do two reps. But my body needs to get used to 115 again. And the only way it's going to get used to 115 again is by doing 115. So, is that three or four reps? Three, right? I got to figure out what I want to do next. And I think I'm going to do a back exercise. I don't know which one. I'm thinking some kind of row motion, you know. Really focus on the thickness of my back. But which row motion? Um, I kind of want to try. Kind of, okay. Bent over barbell rows. Only because it might help add some extra stimulus to my lower back. Now, that stimulus might be pain, or it could be muscle growth. I don't know. The only way I'm going to find out is by actually doing it, and, well, I'm going to do it. Uh, so for, for all I know, like I said, it could help me out in the long run. My lower back is probably just weak, and who knows, the more muscle I might uh, develop in my lower back, the better things are going to be. <laughs> Uh, uh, two reps failed trying to do two, three hey as long as i'm reaching failure that's all that's all that i personally be care for because now i know that i have to do one more next time you know uh, i'm also feeling pretty weak from today i've had two meals which they haven't been up a lot i what the fuck did i have this morning i had four eggs just four eggs no steak, but other things. Uh, what else did I have? Had some beef with some hot Cheetos, some tomatoes, basically trying to make myself a Dorito soda taco. Wasn't bad. It was okay. Then I had a coffee with a shit ton of sugar. So that's my carbs for the day. So feeling pretty good. You know, I'm exhausted, but you know what? My body is using the, it's, it's available resources, which is the fat. Um, thank you. I'm going to have to go to bed hungry tonight and kind of load up some extra food tomorrow. Uh, cause I definitely want to hit on new low away to this morning. I woke up at two eighteen point four, So I'm back where I was last Friday. Uh, I basically just lost four or five days of weight loss, but potential weight loss. But if I keep on this trend, I should be able to lose more. Uh, I might need to slow it down, to be honest, because well, I'm losing too much fat or whatever the weight is very quickly, which is not a good thing. So slower, better, but getting kind of patient. I definitely want to be like at 218, sorry, 215, ideally 210 uh, before I slow down. But uh, you got to be careful because this weekend is... I'm flying out to North Carolina where a lot of stuff is happening right now. We're going to Charlotte. We were supposed to go to Asheville, but Asheville is now currently in the water. Uh, hopefully things turn around for the better in Asheville, but in Charlotte, to us going for a wedding. Uh, my girlfriend was invited to, so uh, this weekend is going to be kind of tricky because Thursday we fly standby. So don't know when we're going to get in a flight. Don't know what time we're going to be arriving, so uh, Thursday's going to be kind of tricky on getting my steps in and getting a workout in. So Thursday might have to be a rest day. Friday, I should be able to use a hotel gym. Oh, I guess Thursday I should be able to use a hotel gym too. But Friday, uh, I should be able to use a hotel gym during the day, during my work day. Uh, but after like 5 o'clock, we're going straight to the wedding or the reception. And then that's going to be kind of tricky because we're supposed to be drinking, eating, whatever. So that's going to be hard. Saturday, I believe we're heading back Saturday. So I should be fine there. Again, we fly standby, so I don't know what the 
logistics of that's going to be. But those three days, I'm going to do the best I can. And when that's out, I don't think I'm going to be able to take much scale. So I got I to gotta be very particular to what I'm talking about. <sighs> oh, nope, my chest is just done. Let's move on. The back exercise sounded good in theory, but I didn't want to go any heavier than what 95 pounds because i was scared that i was going to injure my back and uh i didn't want to go heavier i should have done maybe some rdos to really stretch out my hamstrings but i think that i'm going to leave that for tomorrow i think i had a great chest exercise for today i mean i didn't do much uh, but it was good nonetheless man it was great and uh, i wanted to do some more back but I, I, I think i should not do anything with my back at the moment I'm just gonna leave it as it is, you know, and then next week we'll see how I'm feeling and go from there. But like I said, it was a great workout. It was good, it was fantastic. Don't forget to subscribe to the channel to keep up with the winter arc because it is day one. You know, the winter arc has started. This is the winter arc park part two because this is the second time I'm doing a winter arc. Let's see what, what's going on because the main goal of this winter arc for me is to really lose as much weight as possible over the next what 98 days i think is how many days we have left in the year which is insane that is crazy to think that the year is basically over you know so i gotta make the most out of this year and my goal is to see how much weight i can lose and really stick to it i have my weight posted on the whiteboard in the office that i spend 98% of my time when I'm at home. So I will be able to look at that. I'm writing it down. So that's going to keep me motivated, motivated and focused to make sure that I'm not forgetting to stay on track of things, you know? So I've never done anything like that. So hopefully it keeps me in line with what I need to do and make sure that I'm losing weight. I have said this so many times and I doubt that I'm going to do this, but I want to get a deck scan to see where I'm at physically how much muscle I have, where I have that muscle compared to the last time I got a DEXA scan. I want to see if I've built more muscle in the areas that I've trained, mainly my shoulders. Are my shoulders bigger than the last time? That's what I want to know. My biceps should be bigger, but not by much. I doubt it. And uh, my legs, I'm pretty sure my legs shrunk. My legs definitely shrunk. Uh, and I just want to know where I put the most fat in, and what areas, and I'm... Yeah, that, that's basically what I want to know. All right, let me go inside. Don't forget to like the video. Leave a comment down below of what you think about this one arc. Are you going to be doing the one arc? Let me know because I want to know. Let me know.